Hello foodies, how are you today? Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Food Really 101. In today's video, we are making a dessert, super easy, super delicious, and it does not take 10 hours to make. So if you're interested in that, please keep on watching. All right, this is gonna be part one, the coconut cream. But before we jump into the video, please pause, hit the subscribe button, support me. I really would appreciate it. Okay, so for the coconut cream, you are gonna need two cups of sour cream. And you're also gonna need two cups of unsweetened coconut flakes. If you don't have that and you wanna use sweetened, coconut flakes you are gonna use half cup of sugar but otherwise you will need one cup of sugar you're gonna add the sour cream into a mixing bowl just like that you could use a spatula to get the rest of the sour cream at the bottom of the container because we don't like wastage all right now time to add one cup of sugar into the sour cream just like so and let's go ahead and add our two cups of coconut flakes I added my coconut flakes here gradually because it was my first time making it my sister gave me this recipe thank you Iman really love it so I wasn't sure like exactly how much I'm gonna need but I think two cups is gonna be perfect one cup for each cup of sour cream uh, and here I'm mixing this coconut cream mix really well to make to ensure that the sugar is evenly distributed throughout the sour cream it looks wonderful it reminds me of that chocolate I think it's called the ruffle <laughs> um, yeah so I'm mixing here and then after I'm done with that, I'm gonna set it to the side and I'm about to make that jelly, strawberry jelly. Okay, so here I have one box of strawberry jelly. This one is vegan jelly. Honestly, I'm not quite sure if it's vegan or not, but I know it does not have like animal gelatin in it. Okay, so here I added two cups of water and then I'm about to bring it to a boil. There's another option. You can just boil one cup, a cup of water, mix your jelly, and then add one cup of cold water. This way it cools off a lot faster. Okay, so this is the strawberry jelly. I'm about to open this package, or this packet, whichever. All right, you're gonna need a whisk here and add the powder slowly and whisk it real good. <laughs> uh, the aroma is wonderful. I love strawberries. Do you guys love strawberry? If you do, let me know down below in the comment section. I think I prefer cherries to be honest, but strawberry is definitely a hit and desserts yeah so I'm whisking here really well to ensure that no clumps are at the bottom of the water and I think it's ready now I'm gonna let it chill cool off and while I'm doing that I'm about to break four packets of breakfast biscuits here I used a toasted coconut flavor but honestly you can use any kind that you have or any kind that you prefer as long as it's biscuits it will do the job so don't worry about the brand names or like flavors as long as you have biscuits you're good to go so I'm breaking the biscuits into small to medium size bites you know um, just like that that takes like you know a minute to do and 
and we are about to layer this awesome dessert. We are gonna start with the coconut cream in a like tray, pan, plate, whatever you have, as long as it has some depth. Smooth the coconut cream at the bottom, just like so. And then go ahead, add your breakfast biscuits. I broke it down a little bit more here. This kind of reminds me of cheesecake, like upside down cheesecake, but it tastes completely different though. This dessert is wonderful. Perfect for birthdays, parties, you know, movie night. You know, you don't need to have an occasion to have a dessert, right? If you like desserts, let me know. What's your favorite dessert? Okay, I'm about to add my cooled off strawberry jelly on top of the biscuits and the coconut cream. You don't want it to be completely cooled off because otherwise it will just be hard to work with. You just want it to be more on the liquid side to distribute it evenly throughout. All right, about to be done. Okay. You are gonna refrigerate your dessert for four hours, and then you'll have something like this. Easy peasy, or easy peasy, I don't know. Slice it up. I just did it in four triangles, four quadrants. You can make it smaller if you'd like. and put it in a plate and enjoy because this tastes wonderful. Look at it. It's shiny, it's layered, it smells amazing. Coconut with strawberries and some crunch from the biscuit. Wonderful. Okay, I'm about to dive in because I can't wait. This looks so good. And I want something sweet right now. Are you ready? So in the corners here, I add some heavy whipped cream. You don't have to do that. I just want to be, you know, make it look good. Do a presentation for you guys. But typically I would have not added that. Uh, looks amazing. About to take my first bite. Hmm. What do you guys think? Mm -hmm. Delicious. Okay, one more. This one for you guys. Open your mouth. I know you want it. <laughs> oh, it's so good. Can't believe I never made that before. But it won't be the last time. I know that for sure. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Like I enjoyed making it. Please don't forget to subscribe. And I hope to see you on my next one. Bye bye foodies.